Take rectangle tool from the toolbar and draw a rectangle here. Now take rectangular tool once again and draw a rectangle from here to here. And you can change the color of this new rectangle from here. Now drag it by pressing Alt key and make duplicate and place it on the other end. Now drag it again by pressing Alt key and make duplicate and click on the rotate tool, double click and give 90 degree here and OK. Now increase the length and bring it to the top. Now drag this one down by pressing Alt key and make one more duplicate and place it here. And make the size little bit smaller, like decrease the width. Now copy this uh, rectangle by pressing Alt key and make it smaller in size. Drag it again and make one more duplicate and place it here. Make one more duplicate and place it here. Similarly make one more duplicate and place it here. Take rectangular tool once again and draw a small rectangle from here to here. And you can change the color of this new rectangle to white. Now select this edit copy edit paste in place and now take mask tool and make a grid here now select this now press a key on your keyboard and select this node on short point, now press I key on your keyboard and pick the color from here. Now press Ctrl and select this node and pick this color. Similarly, press Ctrl, select this on short point and choose your color. So now we are done. Now select this one and keep capacity and now lock it from here now select them all and bring to the front and change the color for those Now select them and from here click on divide and ungroup it. Now select this and change the color. Bring it at the top. Now select them and go to Effect and here in Texture select this grain. You can increase the intensity if you want and click OK. So we got this effect. Now select them and give transparency. Take this pen tool and draw lines from here to here and now make duplicate. Now select these three lines and go to stroke, click on dash line, increase the stroke 
and here you can give some gap even here too and you can decrease this gap and let's reduce the stroke and here the dash is little bit more bigger in size let's make it smaller in size and increase the weight here now it's fine now select these three and make duplicate by pressing alt key and place it here Now duplicate it again and rotate it to 90 degree and place it here. Now bring it down by pressing Alt key and here take this one at the top take this one at down and this one also top reduce the stroke let's change the color for this check this color and bring up to here now select those strokes and expand it and now you can group them and change the color for those let's take some darker color Now take ellipse tool and draw a small ellipse over here. And give the effect to this ellipse. And place it in all the corners. Now bring it at the top and make it more transparency here. So now we are done. Now take this brush tool and draw it off from here up to here. And similarly from this side also.